trim settings of the fillet command. When I go up to the fillet command, you can see I have an option called trim. By default, it is set to trim. So, okay, it's trim. Now I'm going to set my radius. I'm going to set my radius for this case to be a quarter inch. And let's go up, and this is what you normally see. Okay? So what it does is it trims off the corner when it puts in the fillet. All right? So here's the original. Here's the trim. It puts the round fillet in, but it trims off the old corner. Now, if I go up to my fillet and I go to trim and I say I want it to be no trim and my radius is still set to a quarter, I can come and pick on this line, pick on this line, and it puts the fillet in here, but it leaves, it does not trim off the corner. Okay? So I'm going to go back up. Now let's do this again. I'm going to come down and set the trim to be trim this time. And this time, I'm going to come in here and pick on the ones that don't touch. Okay? So you can see, like over here, they're not connected. So I'll pick on this one, and I'll pick on this one, and boom, it rounds that off. Okay? Now, I'm going to go back up to the fillet command. I'm going to go down to my trim and I'm going to say no trim all right and now I'm going to pick the same one that they don't touch okay and so I'm going to come in here and pick and boom notice what I get here I get all right it doesn't trim it off because it wasn't there all right so it doesn't trim off these parts neither so this is probably not what you had in mind so once again the default value is to trim things off and if you switch it to no trim you probably want to go back to trim uh, as uh, an option because that's the way you typically do things okay so whenever we're using the trim option of the fillet command we're deciding whether or not it trims off the corner that's left behind so trim means it gets taken off like here no trim means it stays there